we are meeting uh, Ty Walker. Uh, Ty, it was a pretty intense uh, game the last match uh, against Münster. Uh, what are your uh, thoughts about the match? Uh, it, was, it was a good match. Uh, well, like hard fought. You know, the referees weren't really on our side, but you know, like we have to deal with this. It's going to be like this uh, every game we play, really. Um, yeah, it was good. Well, well fought for the team and everything. Um, and yeah, like the the fans were great. Everybody was great. So uh, I think it's important for us to you know keep improving and and be beating these teams. Like our goal really is to be beating these teams. You know, five zero six zero. And uh, yeah, really just we need to improve in the final third and finish our chances. Mm -hmm. The ref made a, um, well, let's say, a pretty interesting uh, decisions. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> uh, you as a player, um, what can you do to, 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 to stay calm, to stay cool? Uh, I think the most important thing is really to just like focus on our game, get together as a team and, and keep a cool mind. Uh, As soon as you see the first one or two calls not going our way, I think it's important to, uh, you know, like get together and tell each other, like, hey, the ref isn't on our side today. We need to be more focused, you know, ready for anything that that comes our way, and uh, win the match no matter what, really. Mm -hmm. um, Ty, you are from a small town uh, near Chicago. Yeah. So uh, tell us, how did it all begin? <laughs> yeah, it's a long story, really, but uh, my family moved to North Carolina. Um, You know, around you know like my freshman year of high school so when I was about 13 14 and uh, from there I got uh, some MLS Academy looks and I went to Minnesota United for about six months uh, then I went to uh, Red Bulls from Minnesota in New York yeah in New York New York Red Bulls and uh, yeah I played with them for I don't know seven eight months something like this mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, after this, COVID happened, and there wasn't really a place for me to go in, uh, in America anymore. Mm -hmm. And I went to Mallorca and did some training there with my agent now, Holger Gerke. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, so then after you know three, four months with him, uh, he sent me to Germany, did trials at Frankfurt, Köln, uh, a bunch of other clubs, and finally landed at uh, Kaiserslautern. Played one year U19 Bundesliga there, mm -hmm. and uh, after this went to Kreuzer Fürth. Had some problems with my uh, visa. Uh, was out for maybe seven, eight months. Uh, missed the whole season. Only played one game. It was tough, but uh, yeah. Then they recommended this club here. Said it was a project and beautiful city, everything mm -hmm. like that. Great club. So yeah, decided to come here. Okay, great project, uh, beautiful city. Are they are they right? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> <They're> very <laughs> right. I mean, like just looking at the mountains every day when we're training, you know, it's mm -hmm. crazy. The city center is beautiful, the super nice people, everything. Mm -hmm. I feel welcome here, you know. So it's it's very very good. Mm -hmm. So um, are there uh, any differences between uh, living in the U.S. and uh, living here in the let's say in the heart of Europe? <laughs> yeah, yeah, a lot of differences, like. Uh, Uh, the towns, like, you can walk everywhere, you know, it's great, you don't need to use your car to go everywhere. Uh, the U.S. is much bigger, like, in size, you know, so you can't, you can't really just, you know, say, oh, I want to go to the city center and go have a coffee. You have to drive to get there, you know, in the mm -hmm. U.S. And, uh, yeah, the food here is much healthier, I think. It's better, you know, like, and, uh, yeah, like, you don't really see stuff like this in the U.S., you know. The fans, also, when we're playing, are more uh, into the game and everything. The culture is better, you know, so... Mm -hmm. I say those are the biggest differences, uh, yeah, mm -hmm. from the U.S. And what about the team? What about the the, the teammates? Yeah, they're they're very good. You know, good people. I think uh, we train hard. You know, we all want to promote, and uh, we want what's best for this club, which is to get back up into the top level. So, uh, I think we all have one goal in mind, and yeah, we're working to get there. So, yeah, it's very good. Oh, very nice words from you. I uh, thank you very much for your time and for the interview. Yeah, good luck. Thank, thank you. Yeah.